Hello everyone, welcome back to another Stationery Pals video. I'm going to show you 10 ways to use sticky notes in this video, some of which you've never tried before. So be sure to watch all of them so you can learn about all the fun ways to use sticky notes. Before we get started, I have a fun fact to share with you. I'm actually curious about how you usually peel off a sticky note. Most people peel sticky notes from bottom to top, and it ends up like this. But if you peel them from right or left, ta-da! You always get a nice flat sticky note. Do you think this tip is useful to you? If you enjoy watching our videos, please, please, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and tap on the bell button so that you'll get updated every time we upload a new video. Okay, without further ado, let's get started. Number one, making plans. Use sticky notes to assist you when you need to make a plan. Write down on the note what needs to be done, the date, and the level of importance. This will remind you to complete what needs to be done before the deadline. Number two, eye-catching emergency reminders. I'm sure we all have important things we don't want to miss. So how can we use sticky notes to create an eye-catching emergency reminder? First, we need to peel off a sticky note and fold it like this. Then we can stick it on a table. you'll find that it turns into an eye-catching emergency reminder. This idea is incredibly useful for some situations that are very important and urgent, so try it out for yourself. Number three, no more overdue books. Have you ever had an embarrassing experience like this? When you returned a book late and the teacher at your school library goes ballistic? For this reason, I always write the return date on a sticky note and stick it on the book cover each time I borrow a book so that I can remember when it's due. Using these small sticky notes as a reminder is very efficient and doesn't cause damage to the cover. Number four, to-do list. Sticky notes are perfect for to-do lists. I used to keep a list of my daily tasks next to my laptop's touchpad as a reminder. Similarly, you can post these to-do lists on your laptop so that when you wake up in the morning, you'll be able to focus on what needs to be done that day. It can also be posted on other items that you use first thing in the morning. This will prevent you from spending too much time in the morning on things that don't matter. Number five, scheduling on your calendar. Use these small sticky notes in your journal. All you need to do is mark the important events on sticky notes and stick them on the date of the event as a reminder. This way, all the important things for that month will be very clear. Even if the time of the event has changed, it's easy to tear off the sticky note and stick it to another date. Isn't this wall sticky notes calendar cool? But before I show you how to do it, if you enjoy this video, please hit the like button and let us know in the comments section what other content you'd love to see in this channel. Your likes and comments are crucial for us. All right, without further ado, let me show you how this wall sticky notes calendar was done. Number six, wall sticky notes calendar. 
If you feel that using sticky notes only in your journal is not interesting enough, then follow me to make this wall sticky note calendar. First, post the sticky notes on the wall according to the calendar, using different colors to differentiate the weekends. Important days of the month or holidays can use other colors to make them more eye-catching. Each day is a sticky note, which allows you to plan your daily schedule in advance. This wall sticky notes calendar can be used to brighten up your walls and also gives you a cool reminder of your daily schedule every day. Number seven, book extension. What if you wanna add new content while reviewing your notes, but you don't have enough space? Grid sticky notes are perfect for extending your content. All you need is a grid sticky note and you'll get more space. Plus, the note doesn't get in the way when it's folded. What could be better than that? Number eight, clear reading target. Sticky notes can help you do well with your daily reading goals. For example, if I'm going to read chapter one today, I'll put a sticky note on the last page of that chapter. If I plan to read two chapters tomorrow, I'll place another sticky note at the end of the second chapter. This way, you can create a clear path to success for your reading plan. Number nine, set weekly goals. Organize your weekly goals, write them on different colored sticky notes and post the notes in your journal. For example, this week's goals are to study, sport, reading, and social. This way you can have a clear picture of your weekly goals. Number 10, sticky note coaster. That delicate mug of yours doesn't have a coaster yet? Come on, you could at least put a sticky note under the mug to act as a simple little coaster. Do you like my 10 sticky note ideas? Which one of the above methods do you find the most useful? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section. If you liked this video, you might also like the video about my first experience with DIY watercolor bookbinding. So click on this video now to see how I made the watercolor book binding. I hope you enjoyed today's video and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.